Shiny wheels make deals. What does that mean? Uh, you got to excuse me too, man. I've been out here polishing aluminum and rubbing and scrubbing and, and waxing. So, you know, I'm hot. Set this nice cool breeze uh, blowing through here. Um, but back to the subject. Shiny wheels make deals. What does that mean? Well, there's three types of truck drivers. There's one type of truck driver that will keep their truck, you know, shiny. Um, the aluminum polished and tires, you know, uh, dressed and, you know, pretty much like a show truck, you know, all, all, all season, during all seasons, as, as much as they can. Wintertime is hard. Um, then you got the other class, which, you know, they'll wash the truck and that's about it. They don't do anything extra. They just, you know, wash it, you know, occasionally. And then you have the other class, which will, which don't do anything. They'll, the truck gets washed when, you know, it rains and that's pretty much it. Um, but from being uh, in the trucking business for, or just being a driver, since about 2001, uh, I was always one of the, the 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 persons, one of the people that, you know, uh, as they say, take pride in their ride. Um, my truck was always waxed. It was, uh, you know, the, the aluminum was always polished. Now, this is back then. I drove a, a triaxle dump truck. The uh, pilot, the the paint was always waxed. You know, it, it was it it looked good. You know. Um, and that made a difference and that brought a lot of uh, good comments and uh, work that that may not have been available if I did not do that and the bosses uh, this is back then the bosses you know they always compliment oh man you, you know your truck always looks nice you know we thank you we appreciate that and you know that goes a long way and then I remember one time uh, my supervisor uh, I was out there it was cold and it was a uh, it I always checked the precipitation if it was gonna rain I didn't really do too much but for the week it wasn't gonna do anything so I was out there you know polishing the wheels you know cleaning all the the dirt and mud off and everything and he says uh, he I think he he gave me I don't remember what it was. He gave me ten dollars or twenty dollars. I don't remember what it was, but you know, he gave me extra money because he appreciated that, and you know, that looked good for him because I was under his his uh, his leadership. So you know, and he appreciated that. But out here, uh, now that I own my own truck, uh, I I do the same thing. Um, you know, keep the pol the aluminum polish, keep it waxed and everything, and some people call it vanity but you know when you pull up to a shipper or receiver it don't matter which one and you know they see you know your, your truck is nice and shiny and not all jacked up not no the uh, the fuel on the tanks where you see it's all black where it just kind of like spills out and runs down oh, it drives me nuts um, and they feel more confident of you delivering their product as compared to uh, somebody else that um, they're with their truck that looks like crap you know and uh, this is just my own opinion and from what I experience and so and, you know you're free to disagree with me um, but you know if if you're gonna be out here oh one more thing before I go the DOT now the truck I drive, my truck, is a 1990, 1990 Kenworth. Uh, I've got waved through a DOT check stops a couple times. I got pulled in, you know. Um, but sometimes, you know, they just wave me through. They, you know, look at the truck and, like, they see it's an older truck and, you know, it's pretty decent looking and, you know, they just wave me through. So just keep that in mind. Shiny wheels make deals. Uh, and you may not think that people are looking, but they're looking. Uh, see you on the next one.